Johan Lloyd has been thrown in at the deep end to wear the famous Wales number 10 jersey in this Six Nations but is desperate to stay part of Warren Gatland's side for a daunting Ireland trip. After the international retirement of Dan Bigar and Gareth Anscombe's move to Japan, Wales started the 2024 Championship with Sam Costello as their only specialist fly half. Costello suffered a head injury in the first half of Wales' opening defeat by Scotland with his Scarlets teammate Lloyd stepping in. Lloyd also started another narrow loss in round two to England. I see myself as a fly half, said former Bristol back Lloyd, who went into this Six Nations campaign with just two caps. Any opportunity to pull on the red jersey, whether it's at prop or fly half, I'll take it. Fly half is where I've always played. I would love to keep the 10 jersey. Getting the opportunity was my dream to be honest. There are a lot of learnings from the first two weekends. We're a young team but that doesn't mean these are throwaway games. We're still going into them expecting to win and a certain standard from each other. The experience isn't necessarily there from all of us but we've still got that confidence in training and games that we can execute. When we don't, it's very disappointing. The presence of Lloyd, still just 22, as the Wales fulcrum for the last fortnight epitomises the youthful nature of the squad head coach Gatland has at his disposal. Wales have lost to Scotland and England by a total of just three points. Gatland and rookie captain Davith Jenkins, 21 have maintained Wales can't be happy with heroic defeats despite the youthful nature of their side. Next up is a clash with Ireland who are riding high. Wales on Tuesday released Bath prop Archie Griffin and fringe back Tom Rogers from their Six Nations squad due to knee and chest injuries respectively. Griffin won his first test cap in the 16-14 loss to England at Twickenham. Ireland was Six Nations Grand Slam champions last season and look on course for another clean sweep in 2024 after beating France in Marseille and dismantling Italy to date. Wales confirmed Costello is back in training and should be in contention to feature in Dublin. With Griffin out of the rest of the Six Nations, Wales are running low on tight head prop stocks. Leon Brown came off at half-time against Scotland and missed England due to a shoulder knock. Kieran Asarati, who has impressed, and Dylan Lewis are the only current fit number three options.